The Lockheed Jetstar company designations L329 and L1329, designated C-140 in U.S. military service is a business jet produced from the early 1960s to the 1970s. The Jetstar was the first dedicated business jet to enter service. It was also one of the largest aircraft in the class for many years, seating 10 plus 2 crew. It is distinguishable from other small jets by its four engines, mounted on the rear of the fuselage, and the slipper style fuel tanks fixed to the wings. Topic development The Jetstar originated as a private project within Lockheed, with an eye to winning a United States Air Force USAF requirement that was later dropped due to budget cuts. Lockheed decided to continue the project on its own for the business market. The first two prototypes were equipped with two Bristol Siddeley Orpheus engines, the first of these flying on 4 September 1957. The second of these was also equipped with the wing mounted slipper tanks, which was originally to be an option. Lockheed attempted to arrange a contract to produce the Orpheus in the U.S., but when these negotiations failed it re-engined the second prototype with four Pratt & Whitney JT-12s in 1959. The outer engines were mounted beside the inner ones, an arrangement that was later used on the Vickers VC-10 and Ilyushin Il-62. The slipper tanks were removed and placed on the first prototype. The JT-12 fit proved successful and was selected for the production versions, the first of which flew in mid-1960. These versions entered commercial service in 1961. Noise regulations in the United States and high fuel consumption led to the development of the 731 Jetstar, a modification program which added new Garrett TFE 731 turbofan engines with a number of detail changes. It has redesigned larger external fuel tanks that sit with their upper surfaces flush with the wing, rather than being centered on it. The cockpit area has a somewhat more modern looking nose and window arrangement. The 731 Jetstar modification program was so successful that Lockheed produced 40 new Jetstars, designated the Jetstar II, from 1976 to 1979. The Jetstar IIs were factory new aircraft with the turbofan engines and revised external fuel tanks. Both 731 Jetstars and Jetstar IIs have greatly increased range, reduced noise, and better runway performance compared to the original Jetstars. Jetstar production totaled 204 aircraft by final delivery in 1978. Most original Jetstars have been retired, but many 731 Jetstars and Jetstar IIs are still flying in various roles, mainly as corporate and private jets. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Design The Jetstar has a fairly typical business jet design layout, with a swept wing and a cruciform tail. The wing has a 30-degree sweepback and features large fuel tanks at about half span, extending some distance in front and behind the wing. The wings hold 10,000 pounds of fuel, and each slipper tank holds 4,000 pounds of fuel for a total fuel load of 18,000 pounds. 
The wing also includes leading edge flaps not slats along the front of the wing outboard of the tanks these leading edge flaps reduce the stalling speed by an additional three knots, while double-slotted trailing edge flaps span the entire rear surface inboard of the ailerons. The wing incorporates inflatable rubber deicing boots for the removal of accumulated in-flight ice. The horizontal stabilizer is mounted nearly halfway up the fin to keep it clear of the engine's jet blast. One feature is that the horizontal stabilizer is trimmable by pivoting the entire tail fin and stabilizer assembly, which has a distinctive unpainted area at the base of the fin that is noticeable in most pictures. The Jetstar does not have any tail de-icing capability, nor was it required for certification. A speed brake is located on the underside of the fuselage to aid deceleration for landing. The original prototypes used a tricycle landing gear with one wheel per leg, but after an accident in 1962 the nose gear was modified with two tires. The Jetstar is a relatively heavy aircraft for its class, at 44,500 pounds 19,278 kilograms. Maximum cruising speed is Mach 0.8, or 567 miles per hour, 912 kilometers per hour, at 21,000 feet, 6,401 meters. Range is typically quoted as 2,500 miles kilometers with a 3,500 pounds kilograms payload. Typically, interiors feature seating for eight with a full-sized lavatory, or a slightly denser arrangement for ten. The Jetstar is one of the few aircraft of its class which allow a person to walk upright in the cabin, although to do this the aisle is sunk slightly so that the seats are raised on either side. The windows are relatively large. <laughs> Operational history The first prototype served as the personal transport of Lockheed's Vice President of Advanced Development Projects Kelly Johnson for some time. Elvis Presley owned two Jetstars at different times, the second was named Hound Dog 2 and is on display at Graceland. Frank Sinatra also owned one. Sixteen jet stars were produced for the USAF 5C140, as were flight inspection aircraft for the Air Force Communications Service, and were used to perform airborne testing of airport navigational aids from 1962 onwards. They began service during the Vietnam War and remained in service until the early 1990s. The flight check C-140 as were combat-coded aircraft that could be distinguished from the VIP transport version by their distinctive paint scheme. The C-140 as were deployed to Southeast Asia during the Vietnam War, where, in addition to their more usual Nevade testing, they would loiter off the coast and act as communications relays between the Pentagon and the battlefield. The last C-140A to be retired was placed on static display at Scott AFB. Illinois, an additional 11 airframes were designated C-140B, although the first of these predated the C-140 as when it was delivered in 1961. The C-140Bs were used to transport personnel by the Military Airlift Command. 
Six of the aircraft were operated as VIP transports by the 89th Military Airlift Wing at Andrews Air Force Base. These VIP aircraft were designated as VC-140Bs. Members of the VIP transport fleet occasionally served as Air Force One during the 1970s and 1980s. Several other countries, such as Germany and Canada, have used military jetstars as transports for their heads of state, heads of government, and other VIPs. Topic variants Jetstar I Business, executive transport aircraft, with accommodation for a crew of 2 and 10 passengers, powered by four 3,300 lbf 14.7 kN thrust Pratt & Whitney JT-12A8 turbojet engines. Jetstar 2 new production version, powered by 4 3,700 lbf 16.5 kN thrust Garrett TFE 731-3 turbofan engines, and fitted with revised external fuel tanks, 40 built. Jetstar 731 modified version, fitted with four Garrett TFE 731-1 turbofan engines, and equipped with redesigned external fuel tanks. C-140A flight inspection aircraft for the U.S. Air Force, similar to the Jetstar I-5 built. C-140B passenger cargo transport aircraft for the U.S. Air Force, similar to the C-140A-5 built. VC-140B VIP transport aircraft for the U.S. Air Force, similar to the C-140B-6 built. C-140C-2 Jetstar 6s were ordered by the United States Navy, originally designated UV-1, but not delivered. T-40 U.S. military designation for a proposed trainer version of the C-140 for evaluation, not built. AAI Fanstar conversion by American Aviation Industries with two General Electric CF-34 engines in place of the four JT-12 turbojets or TFE-731 turbofans which first flew on 5 September 1986. Only one aircraft was converted. Topic. Operators Topic. Civil operators Canada Department of Transport former operatory Rakaraki Airways Mexico Teza Puerto Ricomenudo United States Eastern Airlines Federal Aviation Administration National Aeronautics and Space Administration Topic Military and Government Operators West German German Air Force former operator Indonesia Indonesian Air Force former operator Iran Islamic Republic of Iran Air Force Karaki government Kuwait Kuwait government Libya Libyan Arab Air Force Libyan government Mexico Mexican Air Force Saudi Arabia Royal Saudi Air Force United States United States Air Force Topic. Accidents and incidents On January 5, 1995 an Islamic Republic of Iran Air Force 
Jetstar crashed during an emergency landing, killing all 12 on board including General Mansur Satari, commander of the IRIAF. Topic aircraft on display Canadac FDTF Jetstar 6 The Atlantic Canada Aviation Museum has a Jetstar that was used by the Canadian Prime Minister and other government officials. CFDTX Jetstar 6 The Canada Aviation and Space Museum in Ottawa, has an L1329 Jetstar 6 that the Department of Transport used to carry government officials and foreign dignitaries, INDONESIAA 1645 Jetstar 6 The Durgantara Mandala Museum in Yogyakarta, near Adisachipto International Airport Airport, has an ex-Indonesian Air Force VVIP Squadron C-140 Jetstar in the display hangar, named Pancasilla Mexicoxa Rock Jetstar 8 Hospital Espanol, Mexico City. 3908 Jetstar 8 Mexican Air Force, Museo de la Fuerza Aérea Mexicana, Santa Lucia Air Base. United States and 175MD Jetstar 2, the Miami Auto Museum in North Miami, Florida has a complete Jetstar on display inside the museum. N329J, the prototype Jetstar is undergoing restoration at the Museum of Flights Restoration Center in Everett, Washington. This aircraft is one of only two Jetstars with only two engines. N428DA Jetstar 6 Marietta Museum of History, Georgia. N711Z Jetstar, on pylon display in false USAF marking as 89001 near base operations and the AMC Air Terminal at Andrews AFB, Maryland. N777EP, a Jetstar owned by Elvis Presley in his later years, named Hound Dog 2, is on display at Graceland, Memphis, Tennessee. This is one of two Jetstars owned by Elvis Presley and or his family. N377SA Jetstar 2, Pacific Coast Air Museum, California. 61-2400 The Museum of Aviation next to Robbins Air Force Base has a VC-140B on display. N814NA, former NASA Jetstar is on display at the Joe Davies Heritage Park, Palmdale, California. XB Da Jetstar 8 at the entrance to Dodson International Parts in Rantoul, Kansas in false Mexican markings. 59-5959 C-140A, in the Scott Field Heritage Air Park at Scott AFB, Illinois 59-5959. 61-2489 C-140B, Pima Air and Space Museum, adjacent to Davis Monthan AFB in Tucson, Arizona. 61-2490 VC-140B, President Lyndon Johnson's Jetstar is on display at the Lyndon B. Johnson National Historical Park. 612492 VC 140B in the Presidential Aircraft Collection of the National Museum of the United States Air Force, Wright Patterson AFB, Ohio. 62-4197 C-140B, Pima Air and Space Museum, Arizona. 62-4200 C-140B, Pima Air and Space Museum
Arizona. 62 minus 4201 C 140 B Hill Aerospace Museum Hill Air Force Base Ogden Utah this was confirmed by former members of the 89th Sam from Andrews Air Force Base to have carried President Johnson and his wife Topic specifications Jetstar 2, data from Lockheed Aircraft since 1913 General Characteristics Crew, two pilots and typically one flight attendant capacity, 8 to 10 passengers length, 60 feet 5 in 18.41 meters wingspan. 54 feet 5 in 16.59 meters height 20 feet 5 in 6.22 meters wing area 542.5 feet squared 50.4 square meters empty weight 24750 pounds 11226 kilograms loaded weight 41535 pounds 18840 kilograms max takeoff weight 44500 pounds 20185 kilograms power plant 4 times Garrett TFE 731 minus 3 turbofan 3700 lbf 16.5 kilonewtons each performance maximum speed 547 miles per hour 476 knots 883 kilometers per hour at 30000 feet 9145 meters cruise speed 504 miles per hour 438 knots 811 kilometers per hour range 2995 miles 2604 nmi 4820 kilometers service ceiling 43000 feet 13105 meters rate of climb 4150 feet per minute 21 1 meter per second Topic: Notable appearances in media. Topic: See also. Aircraft of comparable role, configuration and era. British Aerospace 125. Gulfstream 3. Learjet 25 McDonnell 119 North American Sabreliner